Tonight, we're learning more about a drive-by shooting in Cleveland County that sent a two-year-old child to the hospital. Fox 46's Jamal Goss talked to neighbors who are praying for that boy tonight. Neighbors who live on Douglas Street near First Baptist Church say violence of this magnitude doesn't happen in their community. Meantime, investigators are working to piece together what happened. I know she's going through. A whole lot. A tragedy on Mother's Day has Petrina Bell concerned. She lives on Douglas Street, where investigators say a two year old was shot inside this home during a possible drive by shooting. It's awful. It's a tragic. She was at home when shots rang out. She didn't hear any gunfire, but came down to see the scene for herself. She remembers seeing the little boy playing in the front yard. Like we are a very well close neighborhood, and you know. It's just a tragic thing to happen. It's an extremely fluid case right now. Investigators got a call around 1030 Saturday morning about a shooting. They arrived to find the toddler in the front part of the home and a bullet through a window. Investigators say the boy suffered serious injuries and was alert when they arrived. He was then airlifted to Charlotte. Right now, deputies are investigating if this is a drive by. If it did play out as a drive by, this just goes to show you the projectile does not have any any eyes on it? Gun bounce. No, no. Steve Wells is a neighbor hoping the shooting was an accident. For more than 20 years, he's called the community home and says random acts of violence doesn't usually happen here. We're going to pray for him. And uh, we're going to get through, you know. And officials haven't said if the home was a target. The community now asking people to pray for the two year old and his family. We're told they are by his side as he continues to fight for his life in the hospital. In Lawndale, I'm Jamal Goss, Fox 46.